And I would like Bill's college coach, Dean Smith of the University of North Carolina, to escort Bill Cunningham to the podium. Dean? William J. Cunningham, by virtue of your election by the Honors Committee and by the authority vested in me by the trustees of the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame, I have the distinguished honor to enshrine you as a player in the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame with all the rights and privileges pertaining thereto. Thank you. I guess the first thing I'd like to do is thank the Hall of Fame Selection Committee for bestowing this honor on me. It's uh, truly a great, great highlight. And first thing I'd like to do is uh, just uh, mention a few people that I think had a great impact on my life, uh, some coaches that uh, really helped me and gave me a great deal of direction, not only on the court, but helped me off the court. Uh, my high school coach, Bernie Kersner, of course, my college coach, Dean Smith, some pro coaches that I had, were, which I had quite a few of them, uh, uh, Dolph Shays, Alex Hannum, uh, Larry Brown, Jack Ramsey, Gene Chu. Well, that's quite a few. Now, it's a funny thing watching that film. You think you were a pretty quick player, but you look at that, and boy, I was slow. But, you know, and I was fortunate enough to play with a few players that are in the Hall of Fame now, and that's uh, Will Chamberlain and Hal Greer. And I had the opportunity to coach at least two players that will be in the Hall of Fame, Moses Malone and Julius Irving. But a couple quick stories I was thinking about. I remember when Coach Smith came to my house with Frank McGuire to recruit me for the University of North Carolina. Uh, Frank McGuire's sister lived right around the block from me in Brooklyn. And Coach McGuire walked into the house, said hello to me, and that's the last thing he said to me. He went over and sat down with my parents and discussed my future and would I go to North Carolina. Uh, after he left, my parents informed me, either you're going to play for Uncle Frank or you're going to a Catholic university. And needless to say, I went on to the University of North Carolina. But I know we're up in a Boston area where there's a lot of fans here, but there's one player for the Celtics that had more of an impact on my career than anyone, and that's Casey Jones. When I was drafted, I was drafted as a guard, and we went and played an exhibition game in Raleigh, North Carolina, and Casey Jones stole the ball from me five consecutive times, and that was the last time I was at the guard position. So thanks, Casey. Good luck tonight. But. Uh, you, you know, this is, reminds me so much of the old westerns, a night like this, where you, you see the cowboy riding off into the sunset and the end, you know, just a happy ending, because that's exactly what this Hall of Fame means to me. It's just, all the, I've been just so fortunate to do something that I loved and to receive this honor. But I don't think it's an honor for me. It's an honor for my family. Uh, excuse me. Um, First, I would like to introduce the two most important little girls in my life, my daughter Stephanie and Heather. My wife, Sandra, for 20 years. My brother, Kevin, and my sister, Ellen. And my mom and dad, Helen and John Cunningham. One thing I'd like to say about my parents, 
is, you know, they made a complete commitment to their family and their children. And they were always there, my family, when things were tough. When, when things are going well and you're winning, and, or things are going well in any phase of your life, everybody's there. But your family is always there when you, when you need them. And this is their award. Thank you very much.